Let's work on regrouping tens and ones. The directions read, write a number between zero and nine in each box. So one ten plus 11 ones equals how many tens plus how many ones? So if we use our scratch pad here, we can think of this in two ways. Well, one ten is equal to 10 and 11 ones is equal to 11. So the number 10 plus 11 equals 21. So we have a two in our tens place and a one in our ones place. We could also look at this as if we need it to be between zero and nine. Well, we know that 10 ones equals 110. So we could split up our 11 into 10 plus one and move this 10 over to, with the other 10 to now have two tens and one one. So let's close that scratch pad, two tens and one one. Write a number between zero and nine in each box. Well, let's use that scratch pad. Well, we have one ten, well, one ten equals 10. And 28 ones, well, 28 ones equals 28. So 28 plus 10 equals 38. So now let's look at which digit is in our tens place. Our tens place has a three and our ones place has an eight. So three tens plus eight ones. Correct. Write a number between zero and nine in each box. So four tens, plus 10 ones. Well, four tens equals, let's count by tens, 10, 20, 30, 40. So that equals 40. And 10 ones equals 10. So 40 plus 10 equals 50, which means that we have a five in our tens place and a zero in our ones place. So let's close our scratch pad and type that in. Nice work. Our next one, let's use our scratch pad. We have four tens and 10 ones. This sounds awfully familiar, but let's solve it. Four tens, four tens is equal to 40 plus 10 ones. Well, 10 ones is equal to 10. So 40 plus 10 is equal to 50. So our tens place has a five and our ones place has a zero. Let's type that in. No, super work. Let's use our scratch pad. We have one ten. Well, one ten is just equal to 10 and 23 ones is equal to 23. So 10 plus 23 equals 33. So if we look at our tens place, our tens place has a three and our ones place has another three. So three tens plus three ones. Now we have four tens plus ten ones. So this is going to require a little bit of regrouping. So if we have four tens and ten ones, well, we know that we should only have between zero and nine in a place value column. So 10 ones actually equals one 10. So we can cross out our 10 ones and have it equal one 10. So now we have four tens plus one 10. Well, four tens plus one 10 is five tens, which leaves us with five tens plus zero ones. So let's look for that. Five tens plus zero ones right here. So let's close our scratch pad. Nice work. So now we have two tens plus 10 ones. 
So if I'm looking, our ones need to be regrouped. They need to be changed into a 10. So 10 ones equals one 10. So now we have two tens plus one 10. So two tens plus one 10 equals three tens. And since we have no ones left over, we're just looking for three tens plus zero ones. So let's look. Here it is, three tens plus zero ones. Close our scratch pad. Super job. So now we have two tens plus 17 ones. So let's use our scratch pad. Well, our two tens are okay because they're between zero and nine. So we have two tens, but our number 17 ones can be regrouped. So our 17 has one 10, and then it has seven ones, so plus seven ones. So now we can add together our like numbers. Well, we have tens and tens. So two tens plus one 10 would equal three tens. And our ones left over are seven ones. So three tens plus seven ones. So let's look for that down below. Three tens plus seven ones. I see it right here. So let's close our scratch pad. Click on that one. Now we have four tens plus 10 ones. So again, our four tens is between zero and 10, so we can keep this one there. So we have four tens, but our ones can be regrouped. And since we have 10 ones, 10 ones is the same thing as one 10. So four tens plus one 10 equals five tens and there's zero ones left over. So we're looking for five tens plus zero ones. I can see five tens plus zero ones right over here. So let's close our scratch pad. Awesome job. Now we're on to our last one. So we have two tens, so that's gonna stay the same. The two is between zero and nine. So we have two tens, but our 18 ones can be regrouped. So our 18 ones has a one in the tens place. So one 10 plus, and we have an eight in our ones place. So eight ones. So now let's add our tens together. So if we add our two tens plus one 10, we're left with three tens. So three tens plus our eight ones. So now we're looking for three tens plus eight ones. Let's see if we can find it. It's right here. So let's close that scratch pad. Three tens plus eight ones. Great job. Thanks for helping me regroup tens and ones.